Fuck it, it's a dip way. Ben's tired, but fuck that. I've always believed in you, comrade, since we were little kids and we explored each other's bodies because we didn't know any better. Because I'm your best friend forever. Especially after that false pregnancy scare we had. Oh, wow. I hated that. I don't think my body could handle passing a child. I don't think my mom was happy that I was 13 either. Oh, 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 oh. No, whoa, whoa, whoa. Hey, whoa, they grew up together. Oh, hey, oh. hey, whoa, they grew up together. <laughs> they were both kids. Yeah, I'm, I'm going to fucking fly right over that one. <laughs> yeah, I'm, not touch, I'm not touching that one with a 10-foot oh. dick. <laughs> <laughs> I hope you don't touch You turn to notice that Miriam is making dick. you aggressively <laughs> uncomfortable with their humor. <laughs> Cheering for you. Miriam... What about your dish? If you're here cheering, who's cooking? Tiny food. Short cook time. I'm actually already done. I've been done since like five minutes after we started. So I thought I'd help you. Oh, that's sweet, but... Hey, let me fuck it up. Miriam tosses a handful of spices <laughs> directly into your boiling noodles. It's the secret ingredient. However, she doesn't know that you lied. And the ingredient was made up. And it wasn't you when you were younger. You have no idea what she's talking about. <laughs> Where in the world did she get the Eye of Newt from? Who was that when she was 13? You you uh, shudder at the thought. The boiling pot explodes, sending Miriam flying backwards. The watery noodles begin to swirl in the air, bubbling up into a dark cloud that thickens and congeals before your very eyes. It, it is I, Steve, <laughs> the Spork Monster. Steve? Wait, what happened to Borko? You're not here to battle me, are you? We spork monsters are many. I think Borko had the day off, but you have conjured Steve, and I hate to battle. So I'd say you're doing pretty all right. Also, we're all very unique and easy to tell apart. You might be a little racist. <laughs> Steve is tired too. Oh, hey, you're in the middle of a cooking competition. I love this stuff. It's better than TV. You crazy kids and your culinary skills really impress me. Mind if I hang out? Can I watch you do stuff? I'm bored and lonely. Do you have games on your phone? My wife left and she took the kids. That was months ago. I haven't gotten out of the house since. I'm sorry, Steve. But I'm kind of in the middle of something. Could you fucking leave? Steve the Spork Monster notices that you're really sick of him. And you've got a Grimoire stashed beneath your cooking station. I see what you're up to. Crisscross some magical items and accidentally summon me, huh? Uh, yeah, you guessed it. Sorta. If you're here, would you mind tossing me some fresh noodles and a pot of salted water? I'd love to. I've always wanted to be a top chef, actually. You know, when I was just a little spork pup back in the old country before my wife left me. Did I mention my wife left me? <laughs> it's my only personality trait these days. <laughs> they call <laughs> they call me Karate Bob. <laughs> <laughs> Oof. Uh, inside joke. <laughs> pew pew! Oh. Uh, I'll tell you about it after we're done. You can feel Spork Monster winding up to tell a very long and involved story. You don't know exactly where they came from. Probably the old country, back when they were a little Spork Boy. But it seems like it was probably lonely there, since his wife left him. <laughs> oh my god, every time I have a lie, I have to lie. <sighs> Actually, you know what? Maybe you should watch from the stands. I really need to focus on this competition. What? Well, I just really wanted to tell you that, like, back in the day, ten years ago, before my wife left me. <laughs> <laughs> I understand. It's kind of like that, that that time in monster school that I had fallen asleep during the scare tactics, and when I wake up, when I woke up, my wife had left me. <laughs> The yeah, most divorced <laughs> monster in the world. <laughs> Did you read it? <laughs> you toss a serious stare at Steve, and he takes the hint. <laughs> Never mind. I'll tell you later. That's what my wife said before she left. Good luck. <laughs> By the way, did I mention my wife left me? <laughs> I've been married 19 <laughs> times. They all leave. I'm definitely not the problem. <laughs> I'm fucking crying. Having not suffered this huge... funny, I don't know why I'm laughing so hard. <laughs> Having suffered this huge setback, you don't know how you could ever win. You're gonna summon extra power from deep within yourself. I can do this. 
I uh, have what it takes. I uh, came so that I could win. Your hair turns mac and cheese orange as culinary energy flows through your body. My heart is pure. My hands are steady. My blood is pumping and my penis is erect. My taste buds have been preparing their entire lives for... Yes, comrade, you are the chosen one. You will avenge me. The power you'd been summoning immediately fades back out. You were interrupted by inspiring monologue. Sorry. My heart is pure. My hands are steady. My blood is pumping. And my penis has never been more erect in my entire life. My taste buds have... Taste buds? <laughs> taste bed? I did it again. <laughs> <laughs> my taste buds have been preparing their entire lives for this moment. I will show the world my cookery and my cummery. I thought you were going to say cock. <laughs> <laughs> They've already seen that. <laughs> you begin to levitate off the ground. Energy courses through your body. You know that with this power, you can do anything. The last time we did this, I was doing a Super Saiyan scream. My throat still <laughs> hurts. I'm not going to do it again. <laughs> Except turn back time, which would be super useful because while you were powering up, your chicken pot pie overcooked in the oven and can't be served. But don't worry, dear comrade. You may have suffered some setbacks, but all is not lost. Impressed with your fortitude, Colonel Sanders decides that you have earned his support. You know, you really should drop out. <laughs> I've been watching you today, and I must say, I'm truly underwhelmed. You've been thinking on your feet and rolling with the punches, but it's just not enough. <laughs> he steps up to your station and delivers some hard truths that you've really kind of been pushing away for this whole school year. All three days of it. Stands right beside you. I'm here to help save you from your own failure. <laughs> All you've managed to do is make mac and cheese, and time is almost up, so you're going to need it. Wow, you made a dish that... Takes 12 whole minutes to prepare. <laughs> Did this come out of a box? <laughs> it's just craft. <laughs> <laughs> no, it's actually off brand. It's the fucking like s local store value. Local store brand fucking mac and cheese. You know, this but is mostly plastic, right? <laughs> I don't micro care. Microplastic pellets in your mac and cheese? <laughs> no, they're not. They're not. That would make them macro plastics. <laughs> <laughs> that was amazing. But Colonel Sanders, what about the test? What will happen to you? What about the rules? Leave me alone. <laughs> hey, fuck this thing. You need to find something to believe in and find it for yourself and then pass it on to the future. Believe Following like, the rules has never been my thing. I follow my heart. Don't believe in yourself. Believe in me, who doesn't really believe in you. But <laughs> I'm great. I'm going to penetrate your heavens with my drill. Ah, oh, fuck, I love Gurren Lagan. <laughs> what a guy. I am amazing. Colonel Sanders unfolds a delicate white towel to reveal a drill core and a robot and the most delicious fried chicken tenders you've ever laid your eyes on. Get in the robot. Get in the robot, Monty. <laughs> I'm going to get in this robot, but it's not going to be that dumb robot that kills kids. It's going to be the dumb robot that I get in that I kill kids in. And besides, sometimes unexpected combinations can have surprising effects, like giant robots and the United States military. Uh-huh. 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 Quick and surpass their individual efforts. Are uh. you suggesting we murder children with giant robots? Exactly that. If we combine forces, we can form the perfect food union. Or at least the perfect food anti-union. And we can kill a bunch of kids. <laughs> there it is. <laughs> Time's up, students. The time expired. It's the moment everyone has been waiting for. You, mu you must now prepare to present your dishes. A handful of students stand tall, but the class seems incomplete. It seems we're missing some students. Pop? Clank? Oh, nope. Pop went and piloted a giant robot so Clank wouldn't have to <laughs> since he died. <laughs> from off screen, <laughs> you hear a pure and innocent giggle that can only come from one student. <laughs> I'm flying. It, it sounds like, like it's fuck, that's fuck you. <laughs> it sounds like it's coming from the broom closet over there. Miriam, would you mind? Yes. <laughs> and Miriam goes home. Inside of the closet, <laughs> you see Pop hanging on a broom hook by the elastic of his underpants. 
Not his overpants. That'd be weird. Pop, get anyway. down from there right now. Eva's a dangerous. I'm going to get down from there uh, next time on dual play. I'm going to get down on the next time. <laughs> I'm going to get... Uh. I'm going to put this whole microphone in my ass and then fart on it. As we descend into the abyss, everything becomes more unhinged. Libs are added. <laughs> like liberals? <laughs> no, no, like ad libs. libbing. No, I, <laughs> the way you said it. I mean, we're adding liberals to dual play. Oh, sorry. Do you we not already like the, did. how I say liberal? <laughs> liberal. Get wrecked, liberal. Clean up your yeah. lawn clippings. Crank your fucking hog. Yeah. <laughs> Why don't you go over there and vote, you stupid liberal? Go ahead and participate in your democracy. It's so pathetic. Don't you anyway. know it's worthless? Anyway, next time on Dual Play, we're going to vote. Bye. Okay. Bye.